This right here is real soju. This here is made from Chapsa, which is glutinous rice. This brand here is Toki Soju, which is not sponsored. I bought this because it's one of our favorite sojus and it's great for mixing because it's a little stronger than the green bowl soju. I also have some leftover halabong mandarins from my recent trip to Jeju. So let's try and make a halabong soju slushy drink thingy. And this is basically me and my sister just winging it right now. But first, a shot. It's strong, but you can definitely taste the sweetness of the rice used to make this. But anyway, in a blender, we added some ice, a peeled halabong, and two shots of soju. Then we realized it's a little bit watery, so we added more ice and a little manuka honey for sweetness. And if you're wondering where we got manuka honey from, we won it in a raffle. We don't usually spend this much money on honey. It turned out this blender jug wasn't big enough, so we swapped out for a bigger one, then blended that up until smooth. Then to serve, my sister tried to be fancy and garnish with the peel of an orange, and then tried that thing where you spritz the oil from the peel on the drink. But that didn't really work out. We kind of misjudged the strength of the fruit, so most of the taste was from the manuka honey. But regardless, this was super refreshing and the soju makes an amazing mixer for summer cocktails.